Hey everybody, the Bong is here, ready to continue my Let's Play of Pharaoh's Tomb. We have done episodes 1 and 2, and this is episode 3, The Temple of Terror. And of course it's brought to you by GameAnyone.com, like the other two episodes are. Now if you saw on the end of episode 2, we picked up the Pharaoh's Cross and what well, we journeyed onward. Which we're going to do right now. The Temple of the Sphinx. And as you can tell, this day doesn't look too bad. Not too threatening. Usually the intro level of an episode seems quite easy. You should have no problems here. Unless you do not analyze pretty much the entire area. You gotta check for these shooters, and they are there. Just gotta watch the little indents, like I said before in previous episodes. I'll try to grab that spear without killing any enemies. I'll save them for later. Looks like I'm gonna have to get to the point where I actually am gonna have to kill some of these. Oh, uh, I can still clear this. Alright, to save my spears, perfect. The sanctuary... This does not seem like a very peaceful sanctuary, to say the least. But, we're gonna have to go there. Subwardo! Alright. This doesn't seem too bad. Yeah, and get another spear. Let's grab that before it wears off. Let's kill this bat, because we all know I hate bats. Now, let's see. I won't be able to clear that, but luckily there's another freeze over here. Alright, stay with me, everyone. Zabardo! Oh my god, I wasn't even looking at the spears. I was lucky. It's like, I was just getting everyone ready, and I wasn't even looking at the spears to the left. Talk about a stroke of luck. I thought I would have fucked myself over. I'm not gonna lie with you on this one. I got totally lucky. Hippostal Hall. I think it's called Hippostal. Or Hippostyle. No, I think it's Hippostal. Just seems to make a lot more sense. But now I gotta do these jumps again. Okay, I see a freeze, but I'm not gonna activate it yet. There, I'll grab the key. That way I can go get the other key. And once the, sp the spikes are in the right area... One, two, three... Zabardo! Alright, let's go. Before it wears off. Okay, getting that spear over there might be a bit tricky. Do I dare risk it? Uh, well, spears are quite viable. I say let's go for it. Let's grab the key. Grab the idol. Oh. There we go, there we go, there we go! Made it! I don't want to grab that artifact. I think I'll just leave it be. I'll let some other jackass get it. Maybe Lara Croft, Indiana Jones... Care Bears, for all I care. Which I don't. There we go. Okay, that's not too bad. The Altar of Phoebus. No, not Phoebus from Hun Hunchback of Notre Dame. Phoebus. Or Thebes. Uh, I don't think I want to go down there and get that spear because I don't even have the key to escape. Let me grab these coins. Down here. I'll have to kill that spider. Good thing I picked up those spears. Because you are going to need them. Alright, perfect. I got a way out. Now I can just climb and there you go. Okay, like all the other episodes, don't be surprised, this does have 20 levels. But that's the way it goes, right? I mean, every episode got to be consistent, right? Who knows, maybe the final episode will actually have a boss battle. 
I'd be dying to see that. See, I hope this can run. Alright, let's go. The Temple of Thutmos. I take great pride in this might very well be the only complete Let's Play of Pharaoh Tomb. And I died. I mean, I have seen someone else Let's Play Pharaoh's Tomb, but it was only the shareware version. Technically, Episode 1. Okay, I gotta clear this. There we go. Uh, do I want to grab that? I have this feeling it's a trap. I don't think I want to grab it. I was practicing some of this level. This is not a blind run. I haven't finished the entire episode on my own. Therefore, I don't know where every single thing is. Just up to this point and maybe a couple levels beyond. I'm trying to remember where it is. I stopped. Oh, that was close. Okay. Zabardo! Uh, do I want to grab that scroll? I mean, I'm at the exit. I better not. The treasure chamber. For all your treasure needs. Lots of treasure over here. Do you want to grab it all? Of course you do. Especially if you got the chance. I'm gonna stop talking like this because I sound like a douche. Okay, let's go. Okay, I see where the first key is. That was close. If I jumped a bit too high, I'd have been fucked. In the skull! I make a new orifice in my cranium, and that's no good. Um, let's see. Zabardo! Alright, let's get that key. Uh, let's see what this scroll does. I forget. Ah, this one's a good scroll. That one actually blocks that other trap. Because, as far as I'm concerned, there's no way I'd have enough time with Zabardo to actually get to here. Like, I can't jump. So this had to be the right scroll. The altar queen has to put whoever that whore is, but let's go. Apparently she's a gold digger and a very stingy Scrooge. I think I have to be over here to activate something. Okay, that's how you get the first key. Okay, these jumps will be tricky. Okay. Temptation is high. Just like Bob Marley. Um, yeah. Um, oh, that was close. I thought my head was too high. Gotta hit those spears and paid for it with my life. Alright, now I gotta get over there so I can get the second key and then go all the way back to the right. Such a perfect combination. No! What? So two shots, this thing automatically goes down? I forgot about that. I hate those BS things. So now I gotta do all that again. Like, remember, just because I hit save in the middle of an episode doesn't mean I automatically start to where I last saved. You have to go to the beginning of the level that you saved, regardless of how far you went. So I don't really consider it save stating. I mentioned this before in episode 1, might have done so in episode 2 as well, but that's for some of the people that weren't watching the other episodes and just watching this one. It's for those people. But don't even stay updated. Anyways, let's do this again. There's got to be an easier way to get up there. I 
Maybe if I trigger this shot before the platform gets up there. Bad idea. Bad, bad, bad idea, Bonga. Terrible, terrible idea. What the hell were you thinking, Bonga? Like, don't you be like that Bonga from New Brunswick who got himself killed while licking railroad tracks in the wintertime. We all know what happened to him. Nobody came to his funeral because of that. You do, do you want to be like him? Do you want to be like that stupid New Brunswick Bonga? I didn't think so. Alright. You learned your lesson. Now let's do this just right. Okay, we can do this. Believe in me. Got to keep the faith. Keep the faith. Keep the faith. Well, the good news is, by the time this platform goes down, it's not like these things hit me. I just gotta time my jumps, that's all. Like that! Okay, now I got the second key, and now the final part. Getting to the end. And that was close. I don't think I'm gonna tempt fate with that jump. I just don't see it being possible at this point. Okay, okay. Made it. And now for the final part. How much space is between the platform and this shot? Okay, made it. The Island of the Nile. Um, I think I'm going to stop the video right here. But stay tuned for the next part when I play some more of Let's Play Pharaoh's Tomb. Episode 3. See ya, everybody.